today we are playing Plants vs. Zombies 2, also known as PVZ2. And um, I played a little before him, and he played it last year, and um, I think the year before. And Yeah, so I've had PVZ. I had PVZ1, PVZ2 on my phone. Luke used to play on my phone all the time. And for some reason, I, we had a couple requests for this, uh, especially this shout-out is for Jay. So make sure if you guys want to see us review something, let us know. Send us comments. Uh, send Who us messages. Is Jay? Jay is one of our fans who's been watching all of our videos. So when we decided to do PVZ2, I re-downloaded it onto my phone, and sure enough, everything was gone. So we're going to start from the beginning. Eventually, Luke, we have a connector for Luke's tablet, so we'll put his tablet on here. However, we don't have that for today. So we're going to start from the beginning. So if you have never played PVZ2, this is going to be an introduction for you, and we're going to walk you through how to start this game. And I'm going to play on my tablet right now. All right, here we go. So this is the very opening stages. This is the first level where you learn how to do it. I'll be fair, Dad. I'll be fair. I'll wait for you. Here, you can do this. Why don't you do this one? I'll, Why don't you show I'll... them how to play this one? So this is me playing, and yeah, it's pretty quick because... Well, obviously, I played this before. Yep. So what's your general strategy here? So we're starting off. You have the uh, first wave. You've got one sunflower. You dig up the sunflower. Um, my strategy is to put the pea shooters in the back and the sunflowers in the front. See, I go with the exact opposite. I always make a back row of sunflowers first. So how I would have approached this one is I would have put the sunflowers down in the back. And while these first couple zombies were coming, I would have dropped the, uh, what are they called? Potato spuds? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the potato spuds. I'm trying to be a ball right here. I'm you are not, a baller. I'm not putting that or that down. No. Alright, so you have no it. sunflowers. You're not going with any sunflowers? No. Nope. Alright, Luke is going to try to do this first wave without any sunflowers. I'm a baller. Let's see and how that works out for you. Halfway there, no sunflowers, and you're rocking and rolling right now. I can handle it. Yeah, clearly. Oh, shucks! All right, Dang. now, well, you could always drop one of the potato spuds on the bottom there. No. And it goes, spadow! Doesn't say that, though. I think it, actually, exactly what it says. It says, boom! Are you sure? Let's put one down. Challenge, right now. Let's see what it says. No? <laughs> what do you mean, no? I'm trying to be a baller right here. <laughs> All right. With that one, you're you're going to need something else on the bottom. you got the bucket head in the middle, cone head on the bottom. Ooh, let's see. I'm not sure if... Those two pea shooters on the bottom. Is it going to get done in time? Is it enough? You definitely need something in the middle there. No. Oh, it is enough. Oh, and there goes the zombie's head. You need to collect more sun to plant that. He's getting close to the end. Still hasn't put down any sunflowers. He's got the one bucket head. And it looks like that's the last guy left. Maybe there's another wave coming. There is. Okay. Why would you dig it up? You just dig up your... Okay, listen. I like it. It's a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it works. Still no sunflowers. Still no sunflowers. We may... Okay. Let's All right, see. here we go. Here we go. What's it say? Spadow! Oh, your first corn. All right. First so there's a 100 coins there. Final wave. Here it comes. The flag. The cone heads. I do not like how this looks right now. Luke is digging up all. <laughs> he is digging up all of the pea shooters. You'll see how it works out in the end. You want to hit the fast forward here? And here they come. I'm gonna die. The oh no. no! There's no, nothing no, there. No. there. There's no defense. No defenses. How are we gonna win this one? With my what? magic. What? Abracadabra! Make them. Oh, die! Boom! Down goes the first zombie. Boom! Down goes the second. Down goes the third. Down goes the fourth. Down goes the fifth. And there's that hot sauce! Get that hot sauce! All right. Crazy day. Hey, neighbor. Can I have that? Can I borrow that hot sauce? All right for his I've been needing it. Into I've been holding on to this taco forever. Oh, that looked like a good taco. No. Oh, that was amazing. 
Fellow Show tastes pretty good. I should probably be doing this in my crazy day voice, huh? <laughs> I want to eat that taco again. I need my time machine. <laughs> okay, who cares? All right, fast forward through all this. People don't want to see us reading somebody talking. They want to see us killing zombies. In your face, Crazy David, and whoever you are, Penny. No, oh, there's Penny. I always thought Penny was his niece. No, is Penny the machine? I can't remember now. Penny Here we go. Is it and Penny is his niece, whatever. Okay. If you've never read the the comics or the graphic novels, those are fantastic. Yeah, those are Luke fans. has a bunch of those. Those are fan. really good. I'm a fan of my own self. Woo Number one fan of Luke right here. All right, here we go. So we've got the mummy zombie. <laughs> and Luke dropped. Why would you do that? Because I'm the best. All right, so he decides to just drop a pea shooter right away here and Spadalia. see what happens. Spadow! Spadow! All right, he's got, he's got the potato spot in the back row and a pea shooter. I just, oh, I hate you! This Go is a hundred percent. I hate you. This Get is a hundred percent not my strategy. Get out of here, dude! I would be playing much more conservatively here, but Luke's just going for it. If you're wondering what that mummy has in his hand, that's the Sun Stealer. I don't know if that's the actual name. I just freestyled that, but that device steals the sun. I'll wait for another guy in. Then you guys can see what it does. Yeah, it turns the sun red, right? Is that what happens? Mm. It's been a while since I played this You'll one. You'll see. You'll see. All right, so again, Luke's got a nice row of, uh, what do you call them, pea shooters here. I actually, sometimes I actually call them army peas. Okay. Shooters. We got the cone head at the top. Cone head at the top. All right, send in more army yeah, shooters. Yeah, we're going to need a couple here. We're going to need, we're gonna need something else. All right, two. Let's see. Now, this is where it always gets interesting. He's got two pea shooters on the top with the cone head. Is there enough time for those two pea shooters to take him down? Yeah, there is. Let's see. There goes the cone. Two spaces. Will two spaces kill him with the two pea shooters? Yes. All right. Hey. Who's coming now? Oh, Bot guys. Bottom. You got two zombies on the bottom. Here you go. Guys, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Let's see, the sun stealer. Oh, his eyes turn red. He steals the sun. But look what happens when he dies. No, you don't get the sun back, do you? No, nope, but you oh. don't. Well, then why are you letting him steal your sun? <laughs> get that sun. Uh, maybe. All right. Oh, yeah, there's all that sun. Get it all, yeah. In your face. All right, so far, this is a great, a great round here. Oh, did you just see that? Yeah, huge if wave you, of zombies if you, coming. If you just saw that, leave it in the comments. All right, here comes a big wave. Question right now, does Luke have enough pea shooters to hold off this final wave? Obviously not. Uh, I'm going to do my magic again on your phone. All right, so he's doing his magic. Right now, there's only two left. Nobody on that bottom one. But Luke sees what's back there. He's got his defenses. They're not defenses. They're just pictures, remember? Well, defense means that you've got the lawnmowers back there. Yeah. So it, there's no all one. All this time, there's no magic. There's just the game. Yep. And Conehead is about one step away. Yo! Boom. Goodbye. And the top Goodbye. one. Goodbye. I hope you can. Bye bye. Oh, Ooh, there's the map. I, I forgot what this is. Yeah, I don't remember this either. Again, it's been so long since we played the beginning of this. A map of space timeness. Oh, this is where you get to go through the different levels. Nope. You yep. have to get the keys. Right, but you can at least see the different levels. And I'm actually just curious, Luke. Why don't you just show everybody at home what the different levels are before we wrap up this video? So we have Pirate Seas, Wild West, Frosty Caves, which Haley calls it. Yep. Well, frozen level. Right. Lost City. Far Future. Dark Ages, which James always stuck on. And. Yeah, you skipped the. Yep. And whatever that Neon is. Neon Mixtape Tour. And Jurassic Marsh. Yep. Big Wave Beach. Modern Day. And then that. So, Luke, real quick before we wrap up this video, which one of those is your favorite level? 
I'll show you. Guys, guess in the comments, actually. All right, take your guess now. But Luke's going to show you which one is your favorite. Oh, can't Tell him next time. Tell him next time. Yeah, so make sure you come back and watch the next one. Luke, real quick, before we wrap this up, I think it goes without saying. It's pretty obvious, but how many stars do you give PVZ? <laughs> it's a number. <laughs> well, normally it's out of five. However, just throw out a number. Okay. 10,000 times a 10,000. Okay. I give it a five out of five. I love this game. I could play this game forever. It's fantastic. If you want to see us make more PVZ videos, make sure you let us know below. Please, we ask if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. And thank you guys so much for watching. We do appreciate it. We'll see you guys next time. Peace out.